Lawrence Stapleton. We're here at the Atme Cub Training Hangar. In the background, you can see 15 X-ray X-ray. We're going to talk to Steve Williams and going to tell us everything about what's going on in the upcoming year and what he's going to build. Okay, now we're standing in front of um, 2891 Papa. I think it's uh, about a 58. I got to go look at the paperwork again. Um, it's um, been two owners in the last 35, 40 years. Um, I just purchased this airplane this week and I've got a guy that's, uh, we're gonna sign a deal to build up an airplane uh, similar to 15 X-Ray X-Ray. Um, uh, gonna start building it uh, this winter. As soon as I sign the deal, we'll call um, Sean McLaughlin at Airframes Alaska and we'll order uh, fuselage and uh, pistol flaps and I'll call custom aircraft. We'll get a work order for an engine and we'll start the rebuild. Um, we'll keep you filled in on this rebuild. It's gonna be an awesome airplane, great rebuild. Um, this is our trainer aircraft, 8979 Delta. It's what uh, we give our commercial training in and our private pilot training in. And everybody that flies this airplane thinks it performs awesome, goes good, looks good. It's, it's our base airplane that we build everything around. So 2891 Papa is going to be built like 7-9 um, Delta. It's going to have a hot rod muffler. It's going to have an 0320. It's going to have three extended gear. It's going to have 35 inch push wheels. It's going to have either AOSS or Airframes new um, suspension or Acme Aero's new suspension. Um, not, I haven't made that decision. If you look at the panel here, this is the panel I put in. All the airplanes I build, it's gonna have a Garmin 200B, it's gonna have a Garmin 345, it's gonna have a Garmin uh, G5, and a Garmin 660. This is the panel that I put, have in all my Cubs, I think it's the way to go for, um, uh, I don't know, the cost benefit, um, usefulness. I think this is the best panel we're gonna put in. If you look forward, it also has Willow Mountain Ranch forward battery. If you look back here in the back, it's got uh, um, Willow Mountain Ranch lower floorboards. Um, this one's got the original sling seat that I designed that now sport out aircraft seats. I've hired them to, um, to build one off of my design. Um, I now always put uh, some kind of a doggy door in here. Um, uh, right here, it'll have a doggy door. Either the one I built, there's a minor auto alteration or the, oh, the STC can't think of the name of the STC, but there's, it's a bigger door with STC. Uh, we'll make that decision down the road. And then it'll have the minor alteration door here to access the upper and lower baggage. It'll have that. Um, it'll have the L21 windows, which are part of um, Airframes STC. It'll have the only thing different that airplane's gonna have is it's gonna have the P-stall flaps. This airplane, I've got a set ordered. Um, maybe delivery in July. And this will get P-stall flaps. And on the tail, uh, it's gonna have the two bolt spring, two bolt tail wheel spring. As you see here, I put those on all my airplanes. Um, bush wheels makes the two two bolt tail wheel head baby bush wheel so basically we're going to copy this airplane this airplane everybody that flies this airplane wants us to build one exactly like it so our only changes are pistol flaps and a doggy door and we're going to copy this airplane this is this is the status this is the base base of what, what everybody loves.
Okay, when do you think you'll be done with that? Um, completion date is going to be in the spring. I'm building an airplane for a gentleman in North Carolina that is in front, and we we got somebody on it every day. We've got an experimental um, 172. It's going to be a tail dragger. Um, going to have a hot rod 360. Going to have titanium landing gear. Wow. Um, it's going to be a kind of a fun airplane. Um, so we got to get those two two going first. So this one's going to be spring, early summer. All right. Thank you. Um, I want to highlight Birchwood Airport Association is have a membership drive and they have a barbecue on June 4th at Birchwood Airport from 6 to 8. Barbecue grills will be burning. Bring your hamburgers, hot dogs, potato salad, and it's a great time. Hope to see you there.